what's going on everyone so yeah it's been a bit since i've done a video um skate shop day today this should be up by today um where do i even start i'm showing these three because i don't you know i'm not gonna do a video for every single one of them so these two i pre-ordered well not really i only pre-ordered this one this colorways uh according to uh golden era collector there's not that there isn't an official release date it hasn't officially released um again through the shop app guys like i just sort of type it in there and you see like all these skate shops pop up um i do click on their website and i do check their actual website before actually buying something um but most of them are legitimate um i don't think these popped up even on shop i just google searched it and the for the longest time at least since the first time that these were popping up on a skate warehouse and um i can't remember the other uh skate shop which the way i saw them was that jeff raleigh posted that other skate shop up i can't remember it at the moment um impact i believe it was the other skate shop maybe mistaken but i think that was it um these the size nine and a half are done just gone of course common shoe size it, i just hate having a common foot size man um they were just gone uh skate warehouse only had these in eight and a half was the biggest size that they had and of course i wanted these because i want to get all the original colorways so i got two pairs of the dime ones and navy white ones and of course i got other colors of the xlt's just because i really like the shoe um but i really wanted this this is one of the original colorways navy white this white gray one original colorway and the one that's still missing is the black one with the royal blue so that i know 100 percent is an original colorway it hasn't been reissued because uh, those are the ones that I had. I had the black ones with the royal blue. Again, if uh, anybody who didn't get a chance to or like, you know, I guess the younger generation uh, that just look on, you know, Google search or whatnot to see the original colorways. Yeah, you can find the ad. I have like a, a picture of the ad and it has the three colorways like all on top of each other. This would be the first one that's like on top. And then they have the navy one, and then the bottom one is the black one that I had. Which, again, you can see Evan Hernandez skating in, in blue. You, you'll just straight out see them black, and there's like little hits of royal blue. That colorway, I'm not, don't know if I can say it or not. Uh, to my surprise, like when these popped up, when Jeff Raleigh uh, put these up on Instagram, I did send him a message. Uh, he did respond about the black in royal blue because I told him there is sentimental value for those for me uh just because of who got them i'm not going to get into it but there's sentimental value for me with the black and royal blue ones he did say he's holding those for a future release so from what he said we should see the black and royal blue ones come out at some point i don't know when he didn't specify he just said he's saving that colorway for a future release and uh and i'll honestly i can't wait that one i might get two three pairs of that one just because i do want to wear them and have some to put away um, again i love this cutaway cost and twos i never owned i don't think any of my friends ever had them i know friends had the cost and ones the cost and threes um but the twos i don't think i ever saw them in person maybe at a skate shop i never paid much attention to them um the desired ones were the ones and the threes Especially the three in this colorway, man. I really, really like the three in this colorway. Um, Rodrigo checks. You can see see him skating on Manic Matty on the Sorry video. You see Tom Penny skating the, the Costin threes in the white and red. I love that colorway. I think that's the reason I also got this one. Just because it sort of reminds me of that colorway. But I never really had this shoe. Never really looked at it in person. It's the first time I'm actually, at least upper wise, you know, I'm holding it. And, uh, you know, I gotta say, I do like it. I do like the shoe. And I think I said I wasn't going to get these, but I did because I wanted to see the fit. Because there is a black yellow, so it's like, I believe, black leather here and then the yellow here. How that's going to come out. And the white navy ones. That one's the one that I'm waiting for. 
the white navy one was the colorway that I, I did like and that should be coming out later on this year so I will be picking up those and we'll go with the sizing depending on this right here I've heard it's true to the size but we'll see today um haven't worn these I literally just got them maybe like an hour ago I got home from um seeing what was up with skate shop day uh didn't really see anything that I wanted except you know I did want the, the these Janoskis in this colorway man uh, you guys seen I have the black ones not this shape I like this shape better it feels more true to the original one but I was there and I'm like didn't know which one to pick up that and they had these at nine and a half the other ones I have are size nine those take a while to break in I wanted an easier time breaking these things in so I saw nine and a half they had a size nine and the black one so I could have gotten them but I went with the black and white ones we've all seen these already I believe but I love that they brought back the uh, leather shoelaces to cork insole. So I guess now that you're setting it on every single one, this shoe still amazes me today, dude, because it looks so flimsy. You don't think it's going to last long, but this sole lasts so long, dude. They're like, I don't think I ever wore it down. Then you think you're going to blow through this, and it's like got the other little layer of suede down there. These are a very good shoe, but great. But I also got hurt a lot in these shoes because yeah just the cloth and of course it's a sort of like a volk capsule construction on these you know when i got hurt on those this when i was missing these shoes dude, with that puffy tongue because oh man i've had the missing putting your foot back on the board when you do like a shove or a tray flip and you get the wheel right on top of here dude on these yeah instant bruise landing primo i got an instant bruise on those too these man that's when i was missing this type of shoe guys but yeah it weighs some compared to this actually you know what weight's almost the same it's pretty crazy but that's what we got today man what are these the 298s one of the original colorways for the xlt's one of the original colorways for the Genoskis. so in in they're technically all retroed because this is a retro of like the first iteration of the Geno season that came out. And I really wasn't going to take anything. But in the end, I, I really wanted that colorway. I have the black and white ones anyways. Um, we'll see if they come out later on. I was also looking for some Dunk Lows, but they didn't have any. Because all I have is like Dunk Highs, which I haven't gone through. I might do a video. We'll, we'll see on that. I think it's been done to death. And uh, yeah, that's about it. And of course, I don't unbox stuff because it's the point of you guys watching me literally grab a knife and tear open a box i think you know this is what everybody wants to get to as quick as possible um let me go really quick around these again dude these are a little bit slimmer these are closer to the chili pepper colorway i still love the way they fit the way they look they're not as puffy as the the white navy color where they came out and or the dime ones or the gallery department was it for that matter. But you know, they still got some pretty good padding. I think it depends on the shoe you get. Curved tongue. I think that's what Golden Air Collection wanted on the other ones. Uh, the, the, you're getting that on this right here. But again, I, I like it. I love that rally on the little heel stabilizer cup right there. And of course, we all know this little part right here. 6699, doesn't matter which way you look at it. Which is pretty cool. Uh, these should be reflective hits, even on the ones that it looks like they're not, like the navy, the, like the all-white navy, sorry, the all-white and navy ones, those are reflective hits. So these little parts right here on the corner. So before I forget. Yeah, I really love this shoe, man. Really, I don't even know which one I'm going to wear today. I'm wearing my Artos today just because I got like three pairs of those. Inside of these, you got your Skate Shop Day. S branding, I believe it's a yeah neoprene little heel cup here. I always like these little gimmicks in all honesty, dude. Just like the uh, CM901s, the Circus of Muscas, they had the heel cup. And the Musca 2000s, uh, it's almost sucker for that. I love this tongue, dude. This little neoprene right here. Love it, love it. Especially that it's not such a big magnet for um, sock lint. I wish it would have been mesh in there. It's not white. Yeah. We wear black socks. You're going to see all that sock lint. 
reflective hit. Avant Soul. I believe it's a full rubber capsule. EVA metal <laughs> injected missile. Not much for perforation on the size right here. Yeah. So uh, you're supposed to have the mesh for that, but I don't think it really does a big difference. Maybe on the toe cap area right here. <laughs> comes with red shoelaces i'm pretty sure this video is going pretty long but it is three shoes yeah red shoelaces i don't know red might stain so we'll see how we go about that might might be the white ones i don't know yeah man i actually like this shoe a lot might wear these today and i just noticed all of them are white shoes. I, it's just the way it happened, I guess. And these, they do come with the cork. I think I already mentioned that. And it does come with the regular white um, zoom airs. Because you got the little zoom air pad in the back here. Simple shoe, but man, this shoe looks so good on foot. And again, I, it's like I told the dude when I was buying these. The reason... Not the reason why I went in there. I went to the skate shop to see what was up with skate shop day today. Um, I was watching Sean Malto's uh, Pretty Sweet Part, and he's skating these, and I was like, man, the Janoskis just look so good on feet. Like, you forget how good they look. Like Them being like this does not do them justice. They look great on feet. White, black, white. It's all you know, good. But that's going to be it for today. Uh just a little view about these and i do these videos just because i enjoy talking about shoes guys especially skate shoes a lot of stuff coming out from when i was a kid so you're probably gonna see more no matter what but till the next time everyone this is what i got we'll see what else is coming up i am expecting the craggers and navy gray red colorway next month actually hopefully and yeah from then oh and i also did buy the mark johnson but those don't get here until monday or tuesday so there'll be a video on that uh, for the tan colorway it's an original colorway and uh, besides that yeah we'll see what else is coming out and we'll keep going guys all right everyone have a good one